Hello guys, today I'm going to show you three different remote controls for the excellent uh, camera, the Sony ZV-1. I bought the camera with this one and I was happy with it for a while, but uh, nah, not anymore. You can only do one thing with it. When you press this button you can tilt it and then it locks. That is nice, uh, okay, but uh, still. So I discovered uh, Yulansi has this excellent grip. Came in this nice box. This one has also the same remote functions and the tilt functions, which is a little hard. Yep. And then you have this one. This is amazing. And of course, then you can have a tripod at the bottom with the remote on the tripod. <laughs> that is amazing. Real nice. And this one is the one I am using the most. I'm using it on this camera, which also is a Sony ZP-1. This one has a red diode, which is the same one as on the camera when you're recording. So as long as the camera is recording, the diode will light up red. So when I press stop, it will shut off. Very nice. You have um, zoom buttons. You have some buttons on the side there. And you have a lock button. This one I can highly recommend. It's easy to carry on, of course, weighs almost nothing. This one also has the zoom function. And of course, record and uh, all this other stuff. And you can also uh, take pictures. And you have this quick button, which is the same one as up on top here. Very nice indeed. And then you get the nice selfie stick. <laughs> That is excellent. Okay, this is how it looks without steady shot on. And, uh, yeah, I don't know, shaky maybe. And then we extend it. And then the shot will look like this. Okay, now the steady shot active is on. And you get this view when you hold it from a standard grip without extension. So let's extend it. And this is now steady shot on, active steady shot on with the with the, with the camera. Okay, let's see different handheld camera and selfie stick. Amazingly nice. To pair the remote controls, you go into Bluetooth setting and in page 2 you will find the Bluetooth setting. Press OK, make sure this is on and then go to pairing. And then you press and hold these two buttons. And here we go. Then you press OK over here. And then it should be OK. There we have it. OK. Go out to the menu, and then you can check that the zoom is working. Excellent! To pair it with the, this controller, you have to turn the camera off first, so you have reset everything, and then go back to the menu, Bluetooth setting, pairing, and then press and hold this button until the LED starts flashing rapidly. There we go. And here we go. And you press OK. And we should be good to go. Let's see. Right, sorry. There we have it. And let's test the zoom. Excellent. There we have it. Bluetooth setting. It is in network number two and page two. You can make sure this is on. Then you go to pairing. And then you press the pairing button on the remote. Then you press OK. Everything is OK. 
And now it should work. Fantastic. Okay guys, there you have them. The three remote controllers, original one. Very expensive. You don't see one, selfie stick. Cheap and uh, feels good. And then the very excellent little one from JJC. Pocket size. <laughs> I will provide links from up in the corner and down below so you can check it out for yourself. Thanks for watching guys, hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.